Hey guys, I am Martin Fenska and welcome to another of my Part of Exile crafting videos. Today we are in Standard and if you watched the video from my previous Standard crafting session, you probably already know what's this gonna be about. Since I don't really play Standard, I'm using currency and items that I get in other events just for science purposes, you know, some YOLO exalting, YOLO corrupting. Though, in this video, we will only do the corrupting, because a few minutes before I started recording, I read news from the Awakening beta, and there will be some very important changes uh, to item mods. For example, Tyrannical and Glyphic uh, won't be the highest, uh, highest tier after the Awakening hits uh, uh, the full version, so there is really no point in crafting any rare items at this point, because even if uh, we ended up with 61 rolls, after the Awakening comes to the full game, those rolls won't be tier 1 anymore, so the item really won't be worth that much. Oh, there's really no point in crafting um, any rares, and it's better to just save the currency and see uh, what uh, uh, the Awakening will bring. Though, we can still do the corrupting. There might be some changes uh, with corrupting as well, but nothing was announced, so I may as well do it. I don't think they will change that much with this, so uh, let's see what we're gonna do in this part, or in this video. Um, I managed to find quite a few level 20, quality 20 gems, or in case of Auras, just level 20. So, I will try my luck, corrupt these, see what we're gonna end up with. And uh, also, uh, during last two one-month events, I managed to get um, some uh, uniques. Well, some I managed to get uh, more than this, but these are uh, items that um, I carried over to standard. So... I will try to grab these uniques as well. Again, we have two six link, the Cloaks of Defiance, and I'm still trying to get that plus one to socketed gems, so maybe we'll get lucky. But we'll see. So let's start together. This should be uh, 46 items. I hope I can count, and I have uh, all vials that uh, we're gonna need for this. So let's first start with those gems. I'm even thinking that I'm just going to corrupt everything and then just slowly go through it. Yeah, let's do it that way. Let's just start. I probably missed one item there, I think. Okay, one, two, three, four. So, there we go. And um, let's see what we ended up with. Gems, 2020 Life Leech. Well, nothing interesting there. Oh, this added some quality, but uh, not really what uh, I wanted. This Purity of Fire was just level 20, no quality. But nothing interesting here. Uh, 2020 fist damage, no luck so far. 2020 reduced mana. Come on, at least something. 2020, 2023 life gain on hit. Well, why not? That's not bad. 2020 melee splash. Nothing with the uh, increased burning damage. Same with increased duration. Oh, here we go to level 21 purity of fire. Nice. 2020 reduced duration. Oh, this sucks. I even lost the level for this purity of fire. But it's fine. Got the level 21 already, so don't really care. Um, nothing interesting for this haste or hatred. Uh, same with faster attacks. Uh, GMP still unchanged. Um, double strike uh, ended up as wild double strike. So, well. That's not that uh, that awesome. Ah, uh, come on, this sucks. Then uh, purity of fire is still level 20. This double uh, dual strike is still 20, 20. Uh, faster projectiles 21, 20. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, Herald of Ice got screwed. Level uh, quality 17 only. Never mind. Grace, um, this was only level 20 without quality, so got some quality on it, but yeah, not really that interesting. Uh, faster projectiles, uh, 
2020, but already got the level 21 here, so it's okay. Uh, increased crit damage, no changes here. Uh, here we lost the level, never mind. Gong effect 2020, 1920, uh, lightning warp, <laughs> okay. Uh, increased area of effect, no changes, so discharge. Ah, this sucks, I was hoping that the discharge could get level 21, that would be awesome. Clarity, no changes, so level 23, uh, I mean quality 23 spell echo. I think this is the second quality 23 echo I have already. Okay, well, that's not that bad. Uh, purity of lightning unchanged, and uh, <laughs> my second level 21 uh, righteous fire. Okay, that's decent. So these were these were um, uh, gems, and um, let's have a look on those uniques. For some, we already know what happened. So first, um, uh, this Wrathpith globe with two white sockets and the green one, so three of color. That's not bad. Um, here, uh, Blood Dance. I was hoping for plus one Frenzy Charge, so that didn't happen. Uh, still have three of color with one blue, but yeah, not uh, that huge. That plus one Frenzy Charge on Blood Dance, I think, could be worried quite a bit uh, after the Awakening hits the full version because of uh, changes to Frenzy Charges. Uh, but yeah, I already have... Uh, uh, blood dance with plus one to frenzy charge, so I just wanted to try. Okay, next, um, rat's nest just ended up with um, actually, this is four of color. Okay, that was a, a white socket on the right place. This is good. The roll is not that amazing on this uh, rat's nest, but still, I'm kind of happy about this. What about this one? Uh, no changes here at all. Nothing happened with this one. This Suffles just um, got um, uh, a white socket. Okay, why not? Uh, then this um, Rise of the Phoenix ended up as uh, garbage. Uh, for a second, I thought it might be worried something because of that extra block chance, but the rest is uh, useless, so never mind. Here, uh, white socket, I don't mind. If I'll ever play standard, I will probably use this shield. So, that white socket is okay. What else? So, um, here the soul taker didn't get anything. Okay. And now, oh, I already see that the uh, one uh, scepter got screwed. Here we just have um, a white socket. I was hoping if I get white socket on this, it will be the uh, which one? The blue one. It will be uh, replaced with white. But still, why not? Here we ended up with how does it look like? With nothing. This is just garbage. Here, socketed gems are supported by level 10 melee splash. Wow, what is this good for? But okay, it uh, has something extra. The it didn't have though. It lost the increased alley damage. So mm, we got screwed here. Never mind. And now these um, cloaks of defiance. So what's it gonna be? They both stayed Cloak of Defiance, not uh, uh, not uh, fucked up anything here. Just hoping that um, yeah, they got something on top of what they had. Let's see. Uh, okay, this one just uh, got corrupted. Nothing on uh, on top of the normal stuff. And the other one, ah, oh, come on, no changes here either. Well. Yeah, at least they still stayed uh, uh, the unique, the six link unique, but uh, I'm kind of sad about this. I'm just really hoping that you're gonna get something. Okay, but never mind. When I get uh, more items again, uh, I will try some more corrupting and uh, 
maybe one day I'll be lucky and uh, get that plus one cloak of defiance, and that would actually mm, even convince me to try standard here and there. I think. But well, this is all for this video. I hope uh, you enjoyed it and uh, join me for the next one again. And until then, have a good time and bye bye.